Hey, this is Evil Fan or Two. And okay, seeing as I've had it over two years and more on YouTube now, and well, thank you three years if you can clean my first year on Evil Dead Fan One One. I'm gonna do a free side project, which is basically the one part is gonna be um, a secret. That's uh, my it's gonna be Crash Bandicoot One. And Super Mario World, um, basically, I'll play the game until I have a game over and then I'll stop. It's just gonna make a little let's fail thing, kind of, in a way. Um, then there's another part two, will be a special thing, a special video that I've kind of already sort of made, but need to put together. And then the third part is gonna be this right here, which I, which I thought was, was gonna be very cool, thought was a cool idea. And it's to basically, I don't know, just talk about my experiences with these last three years in a, in a way. Um, and talk about everything in general. And so we're going to basically do it as we're going to do the past, the present, <laughs> and the future. And it's, it kind of sounds like it's come Christmas thing, but you know, what we're basically going to do is we're going to talk about the past, um, what all the experiences I've had with the past and stuff. Then we we'll talk about all the stuff we've got going going currently and stuff. Basically this year probably. And then I'll talk about any future ideas I have in my mind, or any let's plays that I definitely want to happen some sometime in before even the Family Two stops. If it if it will ever stop, I don't know. But um, yeah, that's all I'm gonna currently say with this. So let's start on. Let's start off with the first thing, which is the past. Now, if anyone who doesn't know, um, I did originally begin as Evil Dead Fan 101 um, on my original channel, which was basically I originally did it for walkthroughs. I began with the regeneration, I did a walkthrough of it, and it's done pretty well 12,000, 14,000 views, um, something like that. It's like basically between like 5,000 and 12,000 or some views each part mainly has got. Um, but it was really blurred. Um, so I don't really know why it's done really well, but I'm not complaining. And then I went on to do more walkthroughs, and I then randomly started some, which was Ty and. Do I cry? Kaya. Just a bunch of games, and then like, I didn't get anywhere with them. Because I wanted to experience what that's playing was, rather than just walk through. So I've I've kind of really stopped my walkthroughs on my channel. Um, also on the other one one, I like began doing my own little weird videos, where I do a song to random stuff and basically just weird videos to music. Um, I also upload concert videos on it um, and anything else. Well, my mom made a little show, which he yeah, kind of stopped. Um, I don't know. I'm, also, I bought Blood of Veronica's um, live DVD on there as well for anybody to watch. So it's really just become um, a channel now for weird videos and the recordings, which is something I do every day. I seem to have done it since 2009. Recorded something every day. Don't know why. I'm just kind of addicted to it, and just I can't see myself stopping. And I don't know why, but it's just how I've become. So my whole life is on some sort of camera. But um, yeah, that channel isn't really active anymore as much. It's every now and then when I can really be bothered with it. But yeah, back in 2010, um, early 2010, I began to think because I saw a few Let's Players, and I just thought, why don't I try and do that? So, I don't actually remember who if who it was back then. I really don't know. Could have been anyone. So I can't say any names. But I felt like walkthroughs weren't weren't good enough. I was gonna attempt to do both at the time, but yeah, I really got more into it. Let's playing. Like I would just do let's playing and just ignore my walkthroughs. Um, 
And in, in the end, I have done like, I've done Evil Dead, let's play, I've done Rainbow 3, let's play, I've done Ratchet Clank, let's play, Kyle, let's play. So most of them games, apart from Ty, I haven't done Ty. But most of the ones I did on 101, I've actually done 102 now. But, um, I kind of just got into let's play more, and I felt talking through, people would understand it better. Because sometimes, you need to hear what people talk what we're gonna say like if you wanna say do a certain, a certain thing with a, with a, um, a puzzle or something what through that sometimes don't explain how you do it because it might, might show you but maybe there's some ha a tip that the person can say so I kinda just got into let's play more and I, haven't, I don't really do what throughs with it anymore but I have begun a what through channel um, but I'll get into that with the present um, in the next part or whatever. But yeah, I, I began doing lots of Let's Plays. Um, in 2010, I went through Sly Raccoon, my original Let's Play. Um, I was a bit nervous with that one. Kind of like, am I really going to be successful? Or am I going to really... I'm not really being successful. It's more like, am I really going to sound good for me? I mean, I've never really been successful, but, I mean, like, I don't know, I don't know how to describe it. Am I going to be something that wants to continue, basically? Am I going to be good enough for myself? So, basically, yeah. I mean, I, I mean, I watch my Let's Plays, and I try and keep up with them, even though it's hard, because I upload so many, but uh, we'll get into more stuff like that later on in this. Uh, but, yeah. I do actually watch my Let's Plays and I do enjoy them, which is kind of may sound weird, but I do enjoy it. And sometimes I feel like my videos don't get enough views, but at the end of the day, there's nothing really I can do about it. Really, really, I can't force people to watch my videos. So, but I mean, one thing I don't understand is how robots is doing so well. I'm not complaining, but of all the games, robots. But anyway, moving on, um, I then began side 2, um, and I had a vote going on, and South Park won the vote, and I began so South Park. Um, so basically, I began doing those Let's Plays regularly. Um, I began enjoying like, doing Let's Plays more, even though South Park was kind of a struggle, due to it being, I don't know, more harder, to, harder as a game. Um, yeah, then I, I'm trying to use my YouTube in general to help me with this. So, sorry about this, let me just go down a bit. Okay, yeah, then I began another Let's Play, which was Malice. An unknown game that nobody really knows about. Um, I also did a walkthrough of Malice on my 101 account. But the thing is with Malice, I like, um, it's, it's, it's good, um, the style and everything, I mean. Like back then, my first A Let's Plays are all tape quality, so they're not as good as they are now, but but with Malice, halfway through, it becomes really blurred, which, it doesn't stop till the end, but there's about four, about five or six parts which are just blurred, and, and my audio thing was using camera, so it wasn't microphone, so it kind of seemed really weird. It didn't seem like my usual thing. Obviously, something else about me is I do the hey, hey, this is a bit of fun too, like a lot of time. But originally, with my side one and things, I don't think I did that. And I, I never really had, had it there. That's kind of been a recent, more, not really recent, but maybe it was more at the end of 2010. It began. But yeah, I went from Marius and then I did my own weird little 3D game maker game, Pivot's Evil. <laughs> and nobody will ever really probably find because. I mean, it's not really a game, it's just my own little thing. And people aren't going to like, type in Pew Zero. So, yeah, that's one where it's like, who's going to really find it? I mean, it's not very really that good in general, but who's going to find Pew Zero? I mean, no, one, no one's going to type Pew Zero in. But anyway, I'm not really bothered because it's only my own thing. Okay, so then I went to Sly 3, and Remember 3, and Jinx. Jinx finished off 2010. Um, Jinx is my only Let's Play, 
and I think it's my only videos on my channel which are over 15 minutes like there's a part that's 22 minutes uh, there's a part of 17 and so on uh, but I didn't have the 20 minute thing for very long it disappeared after about a month so that was unfortunate because I would like to use a 20 minute thing to help me get through games quicker and less parts but due to copyright issues because I use songs which I'm claiming that they're not my basically they're not my songs I mean I don't sing well, I do sing myself but not like it's just my own thing when I'm bored or whatever but like I don't sing like a female I don't I don't have a female voice so I'm, I'm not get, I'm not copywriting anything copyright is complete to the, the bands and the music and everything and the companies and stuff so yeah so I'm not gonna get into all that but um, because of that, um, I haven't got. I can't do a 20 minute thing, so. Oh well, I'm not gonna moan. I've got a lot further than that. Okay, so basically, I think Member 3 was a good successful let's play. It took me 44 parts to die. So that was pretty good. So my first death was at f part 44. My side 3, I don't know, it kinda went weird. I mean, in the pirate level, level 5, at some points, a few parts are like mute nearly. I think it was tape issues. By then it was tape. Um, and it ended up being bad quality tape. And it ended up really being really quiet. Um, and I think them parts have actually called like, you might as well mute it or something. Because, I mean, they were really quiet. But anyway, moving on to 2011, which was last year. As you all know, I did quite a lot of let's plays last year. Um, I did lots of things. Um, so, what did I do? I did Ratchet and Clank 1. Um, and memorable things about that is I began it. <laughs> that's not very memorable, that's just obvious. I mean, you obviously begin it. Um, and the good thing about Raging Clank 1 is, I nearly did it 100%, but it was just one thing I didn't do. I mean, I even bought the Rhino. The only thing I didn't do in Raging Clank 1 was, um, there was a skill point I couldn't do, and I ignored it. Well, I, I had many attempts, but then I just gave up because it was just, it was just not working for me. Um, I did Cut Tower 3, um, I did Kaya down in the, um, the league. Robots, which is my current and the most successful let's play on my channel. Um, part one is at fourteen thousand, which is a, which is actually a lot for me. Um, yeah, looking at my complete list, I did a slide show just speed up of Cyrocoon. Yeah, I, don't, I just randomly decided to begin that and just don't know why. I thought it'd be kind of funny, not funny, but just different. It's five parts and it's just basically. Each part is like a level and it's speeded up. Yeah, it's not really anything that exciting. Then I did Evil Dead Regeneration. Um, that went well. I did Ratchet Clank 2, Going Commando, and I was obsessed with Big Head. Um, so, sorry about people who don't like Big Head. But that's what it was like. That was the whole let's play really. Just to do Big Head. I did Harry Potter Foss of a Stone for PS1. I did Spyro of a Dragon, and I really like the Spyro, the Spyro of a Dragon, I actually completed the game, and I, I never completed it before, so I think that went well. I did Dead Alive 2, Tina Story, <laughs> one part, I was going to do more, but I, I couldn't be, I, I just changed my mind and just decided I wanted to do that. Um, I did Ratchet Clank 3, which was done, I did a lot of it in one day, I remember one day, um, I spent, I did like 8 worlds in one day, so a lot of the game was done in one go. Infamous, that took me like a long time to do. That took me nearly the whole, about half a year to be. Uh, it was probably the let's play that as the most me being annoyed. But, but in general, I mean, I beat the game. I did every side, mi side mission, so I'm pretty proud of that. Uh, 